class will finish up today's lecture with this incredibly useful formula. You may go now and have a great vacation. How exciting! Our flight is tomorrow! I won't even be able to sleep tonight with how excited I am. Girls, go to sleep. We have to wake up early tomorrow to head to the airport. Hi, friends. Snickerhoops here, and welcome to another Toka World gameplay. Today, I have another story for you. Let me know if you like it. So, we have six university students. They're on vacation, so they're going to go on a trip. They're about to fly somewhere. But the plane is going to crash, and they're going to get lost in the jungle. I'll introduce you all really quick. We have... Sabrina, Amy, and Brianna. On the other side, we have the guys, and we have Logan, David, and Vincent. Well, friends, I'm not going to interrupt anymore. I'll continue telling you what happens in the story. Well, I packed. All I need is to put on my sunglasses, and I'm done. Oh, I was forgetting this dress. I'm so happy I saw it there. How about we bring some gum, girls? Oh, I still need to pack a lot. Oh, I definitely can't forget sunscreen. I packed so much. I don't think my suitcase will close. Oh, good. It finally closed. Ah, my phone. My phone. Where's my phone? Girls, have you seen my phone? Oh, I'm starving. Yo, where are we going to eat? Are we going to eat at a restaurant or are we going to eat at the airport? We'll be eating at the airport. That way we make sure that we're not late and we're on time for our flight. Girls, my phone. I can't leave without my phone. Oh, Sabrina, this is just like you. You're always losing everything. You'd lose your head if it wasn't attached to your body. <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, girls, where's my phone? Well, think. Where did you last use it? Let me think. Definitely yesterday. I was washing my clothes and talking to my mom. Here, here it is. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, well, ready, girls? Okay, girls, we decided that we're going to eat at the airport, so we make sure we're not late. Sounds good. Here you go, sir. Here's your passport. Everything's in order. Okay, we've showed them all our passports. Let's check in our luggage. Oh, this part always makes me nervous. <laughs> You can go through, ma'am. Thank you. Oh, please let everything be okay. Please let everything be okay. You can go. Thank you. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to open your luggage. I saw something. Oh, no, ma'am. You can't take this. Oh, my sunscreen. No, that sucks. Yeah, they didn't let me take my shampoo or my cologne either. I'm sorry. It's airport rules. Don't worry, girl. Once we're there, you can buy a new one. I know, but this one was brand new. You know what? I'm not going to let this ruin my trip. Yeah, that's the spirit. Mm, I'm sorry, sir. This weighs too much. You're either going to have to take something out or you're going to have to pay a little bit more. Uh, no, I don't want to pay more. I don't have any more money. Don't worry. I'm not carrying too much. You can put some of your things in my backpack. Here you go, sir. Next in line, please. Uh, we're finally through security. But the problem is that we don't have time to eat now. We had planned to eat in the airport. And now we can't. And I'm dying of hunger. Oh, yeah, me too. I'm just going to get something from the vending machine. Oh, <laughs> What's this thing that fell out here? I wanted something to eat, not a stuffed animal. Uh, give it to me. I like these things. Okay, who wants milk? Me! Me too! Who wants juice? Me! Back here! Oh, I don't have any more hands to carry the juice with. Uh, I'll just put it here in my backpack. Potato chips, potato chips for everyone. I want the fruit. Oh, I want a fruit too. Passengers for flight 459, please prepare to board the aircraft. Oh, I want a window seat. Me too. All three of us girls will sit by the windows then. Oh, I'm going to see if everything fits up here because I got a lot of stuff. Yay, that's awesome. I fit. Good idea, bro. I'm going to put mine in too. Well, if you guys are going to put your stuff up there, then I might as well put mine up there too. I'll just hang out with this little friend that I made. <laughs> This suitcase weighs so much. Oh, ma'am, ma'am, please, please, please. Uh, let me, let me help you put that up there. Uh, would you like me to put this up here? Oh, yes, young man. How nice of you. Oh, good. Wow. Whew. We almost didn't make it. I'm glad we made it. Oh, yeah, mom, me too. Oh, wait up, wait up. Please wait for me. Oh, no, I couldn't sit with my family. Hmm. I guess I'll just sit over here. Oh, wait, sir. Uh, if you'd like, I can move over here, and that way you can sit next to your family. Oh, thank you, thank you. Passengers, please buckle up your seatbelts. The plane is about to depart. How exciting! We're about to lift off! Passengers, in the case of a crash landing, please put on your oxygen masks first. Look, look, I leveled up, I leveled up.
hold up! Hey, don't distract me right now! I'm trying to listen to the lady's safety presentation! Ah, who actually listens to those? What are you talking about? What if the plane crashes? That's not gonna happen. Okay, time to offer some beverages and snacks to the passengers. I'll bring a few donuts, some cupcakes. What can I get for you, sir? Water, please. Here you go. Sir, a uh, cupcake, please. Oh, delicious. Mmm, <laughs> what refreshing water. Oh, oh, can I get a donut over here, please, sir? And I'll take a soda. Okay, in a glass. Yes, please. Here you are, young lady. Thank you. Mm. Oh, no. What's happening? Why is the airplane moving like this? Passengers, passengers, please, please calm down. We're having some technical problems with the plane. But don't worry. Keep your seatbelts fastened. I repeat, keep your seatbelts fastened. And where are we? It looks like the plane crashed. We're in the jungle. Calm down, kids. Fortunately, the plane crashed here in this area for scientific study. And another good thing is that everyone survived. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, look, even my little stuffed animal's here. Awesome. I knew it. It did bring us good luck. I'm going around picking up all the luggage we were able to rescue and putting it here. Ah, uh, my leg really hurts. Please don't worry. We're going to help you. We've already requested a medical plane to come here and tend to every single person from the crash. Ah, uh, my ribs really hurt. Drink some water, ma'am. You'll feel better. Well, guys, this isn't the adventure we were expecting, but it certainly is an adventure. How about we go explore the jungle? Yeah, what a good idea. I'll go with you. Let's go, let's go. I'm going to bring my phone, and I'm also going to bring my suitcase. Maybe we're going to need something. Wait, girls, that's very dangerous. Uh, in situations such as these, the best course of action is to stay with the group. We're not going to separate from the group. We just want to go explore. Come on. Wait, wait, don't go alone. Hours later. We've been walking for three hours and we still haven't been able to find that scientific research area where the plane crashed. Oh, we should have just stayed there. Now we're lost. Oh, I'm feeling really dehydrated right now. Can we drink water from here? And my phone doesn't have any reception. Oh no, what are we gonna do? We're lost in the jungle. Oh, I'm so happy they have a bathroom here. Oh, I was dying. It's been several hours since Amy, Vincent, and Sabrina left. Well, knowing how Vincent is, I'm sure they'll be fine. I don't think anything's happened to them. I don't know. I'm not too sure. Maybe we should go look for them. And uh, no, I think I'd rather stay here. Uh, they'll get back soon. Oh, I'm so happy this poor woman fell asleep. Oh, poor thing with a broken rib. She must be in a lot of pain. I'll turn off the light and I'll lower this curtain so she can sleep better. Seriously, guys, I'm really concerned. It's nighttime and they haven't gotten back already. Ah, a bat! Did you hear that, guys? It sounded like a wolf. And my phone's about to die, but I still don't have any service. Well, panicking won't help us. The best thing we can do right now is look for a safe place for us to spend the night. Spend the night here? How scary. Friends, that's how part one of Lost in the Jungle ends. If you guys still haven't subscribed to my channel, then run and hit that subscribe button. And then while you're at it, go ahead and click that bell so you guys are notified every time I upload a new video. And you won't miss the second part of Lost in the Jungle. I can't wait to find out what happens to these young college students who love adventure. And well, friends, look what I found here completely by coincidence. When we were in the airport, we got this little cutie. And I think it's one of those crumbs bits you guys have been telling me about a lot in the comments. And guess what? I came here and I found a lot more crumpets. It's super interesting. They have beds, like little houses. Super adorable. And they're all over the place. I think I saw a few more here. Oh yeah, there it is. Oh, it's exercising. Super, super cute little animals. But what I wanted to ask you guys, friends, in the comments, let me know if you'd like us to go crumpet searching all over the place looking for their houses. I think there's another one here. It looks like it. Oh no, this is a little snail. Let's see over here. There's another door. Oh no, 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 no one's there. Okay, well, I don't know, friends. I have a feeling these crumpets are everywhere because you guys have been telling me a lot about them in the comments. And friends, don't forget to go subscribe because we just hit 5,000 subscribers. And how about we get to 10,000? 